Hello everyone. So today we are going to look at how we can make a traditional origami creation like this that I have in my hands. Can you see? So this is called kabuto in Japanese. It's also called a samurai hat. It looks like a hat. See, if you make it a bit bigger, you can even wear it on your head. So you have heard of samurai from Japan, right? So this hat actually looks in shape like a samurai's hat. So now let's see how we can make it. Okay, now I have used a piece of paper where you get two colors on either side, two patterns, so that these patterns can be visible in your hat. So it doesn't really matter what sort of a paper you use. Actually, if you use a bigger newspaper, you may even be able to wear it and play. Now let's see how to make this. So we'll fold it like this and make our triangle. Press on the edge. And now this corner has to come to this corner. This is quite easy, I know for y'all, because we have done this so many times. Now see these edges. We don't need those edges. Now we take the open side to our side. And then this corner goes up to the other corner. And this corner also goes to this corner so that they all meet. Now this piece, how we will fold it is, we have to press on this corner and then this corner we have to fold it slowly so that there is a little piece protruding from this corner we can't fold it any other way we have to make sure that it is parallel and protruding out of the out on the sides now this flap here we have to bring it up but don't make it go to the very corner and don't stop it in the middle either. And then along this middle edge, we have to lift up that little flap. Make sure that it's clean and we have a proper line. And this is the front part of our hat. And now we are going to make the back of our hat. Fold it. And now open it like here, like an envelope. And then slowly insert that upper flap inside so that there are no parts protruding outside other than the top parts. And now that's a samurai hat. So now, like I told you, in Japan, People or children actually make samurai hats using newspapers and they play at games at war and as warriors. Now, since we have a shape like this, we can even use it as a bookmark on the edge of a page or a book cover like this. Can you see? It's pretty, isn't it? Now we learned earlier how to make a corner bookmark, but we can also use this as a corner bookmark. So we plan on making a lot of creations like this. So don't forget to join us and our videos with your parents and have lots of paper with you so that we can make these creations. Like, subscribe, comment on our YouTube channel. See you soon.